Hi there, this is Jeb Adams, still here with Singer 500J Gina. And what we're going to do right now is we're going to remove the cam stack. So, where's my list? Where's my cheat sheet? Okay, we got to make sure that the knobs are set at... Oh, geez, it's going to be checked because this one's not at A. That one's supposed to be at K. And what's this other one supposed to be at? It doesn't say what this one has to be at. So I guess I'll put it to, I'll put it there in the middle at three because that's where it's kind of, it's got the cutout there. Looks where it might be the, the home position. So it says, I've already removed the top cover. Now I have to remove the special disc. So you stick your screwdriver in the slot right there, and there, it cracked loose. So there's a washer on here, spring washer. We can't see it right now because we're looking down at it vertically. But there's the, there's the washer that goes on on this. Now I haven't rehearsed the names for these parts. All I'm doing here is getting this cam stack off. So, okay, where's my list? Back to the list. Remove large US. I moved that with its spring. Now it says remove cam stack. M5. Oh, yeah? Well, I guess I just removed it. Wow. Isn't that a little bit gunky? Isn't it? Yabba dabba do. So, let's kind of stop and take a look. I'm going to wipe my gloves off, especially the, the right handed glove. And. Let's maybe raise this up a little and then we'll get a better angle of it. And then I want to zoom in some more. Oh. There, because what I'm trying to let me move this back a bit. Let me get this other light in here. And then I need... Well, I'll just go with that for now. What I'm trying to... get a look at in here is right in here and all this gear stuff because I want to get it clean. So let me get my other flashlight and I want to be able to light it bright enough so that you can see what I'm talking about. See there's the worm gear there. You can kind of see just the, the top of it. Let me try with this light. Let me aim the camera a little higher. There we go, we can see it there. Some worm gear. Yes sir, right in there. So, so I'm gonna be able to clean that. I'll be able to clean this well now. And I'll see how what kind of access I have for cleaning all this stuff. The next step is to remove all of this. And that's a quite involved step from what I can see in the instructions. So I think I'm going to have a pretty good go at cleaning this gear down here, this one here. 
this worm gear in here. And then I'm still going to clean all this stuff kind of in place. And we'll see how that goes. I still have to get in and clean in here and in here and in here and then down below. I still have to clean the bobbin assembly that goes in here, in this area here. And now we've got the amazing cam stack to, to clean. I'm really quite, quite pleased with this. Oops, sorry. So, it's going to be nice to, to get this clean and to get all this clean. You know, this, this will be, this will be good for, for a few years. And you know, these are all steel machines. I think they would last a hundred years. What do you guys think? Anyway, if you're still watching, um, I'm, I'm entirely self-supported, but I, I do appreciate support in the forms of, of likes and subscribes from, from viewers, if you feel so inclined. Thank you for viewing. Thank you for liking. Thank you for subscribing. And if you have any comments or uh, issues with, uh, with sewing or with your machines, I'd love to hear about them. I think I will be doing some sewing. Uh, this is not really a sewing blog, but I can see that uh, maybe just on the side, I will learn how to sew some masks because I've been checking out a, a bit. But anyway, I wish you all the best. Keep safe, have fun, and thank you for visiting. I really do appreciate your support, and please come on back. Ciao for now.